All right, welcome everybody. Today we are playing a game called Mass. All right, let me kill. Okay, now that I can talk. So, if you like anime, like, such as Gundam, this is a very Gundam-esque game. I had the demo of this game. This is the actual first level of the demo. But, you got three different weapons. I prefer the sword. Apparently these things are called quarks. For the most part, all I did was play the tutorial. I feel like something's still attacking me. Can't... I hear him, but I don't see him. Oh, let's investigate this tower. But yeah, you can like completely customize your Gundam or mass in this situation. Okay. Looking for where I am supposed to go. Why'd you not let me investigate that one early? As far as I know, this is still in... Alright, we've got covered all manufacturing towers. From your camera feed, we can see they are attacked by quarks. I am reading large. Any signals, please check it out. Okay.
Mission clear. Okay, so they're giving you like 30 seconds to the end of the mission so you can pick up everything. Sorry. I'm not very good at hack and slash games. As you can see, I have it on easy just to show you guys this game. We got quite a bit of stuff. Moving your hands around the more than a few minutes, you will finally finish setting up your mass frame to return to base on autopilot. It would take at most a few hours to reach where you are from the mission. Welcome back, Commander. You did great out there. Everyone at the base was excited with your first mission. Uncle Kale is very relieved to see it went well. Would you mind meeting with him for now? So this has a very, very Japanese influence. And your mercenary company, I named my mercenary Nighthawks, after my favorite jet fighter, the F-117 Nighthawk. But if I go to, like, armors, and I go to... You know, let's just cho change the top of my head. Like, eat, that's your face, top, side, neck, like, chest, mid-torso. Oh, it says right up there. Let's say I want a different face. I can go to armor. And like, say I want one of these, cost. Blitz face, cost, I don't know how to obtain it. Probably through development. But like, I can change it to this. Kinda gives me like a Yoshi Mitsu type look. I kind of like it, so I'll save that. You can change, like... I'm a big boy now. You can change your eye. Eye flare color. So mine are bright blue. I can make them... I can turn them off by making black, straight white, make them pink, make them just orange, like, I like how my frame set up. It takes a couple minutes to set up your frame, how you like it. Then, for instance, you have your sword. So, I have many different grips. And you can see how much he has planned to add. Well, how much they have planned to add. So you can make it more like a combat knuckle, or more like a rapier, halberd, spear. So we'll go with this grip. So we'll save that. Really, it doesn't look like I can do much of it. I wish I could mess with the blade, but I might, I might be able to, I don't. So I want one, three, and four to be the blue metal that I've been using. 
It will make two gunmetal. Select. Alright. So now I can take a look at my blade. Unfortunately, I would. So we'll just stick with that one right now. I'd prefer one of these two. Or like that, because that kind of looks like it's a katana blade, apparently. <laughs> Okay, but all right, we're gonna make those the blue metal. Leave that gun metal. Now, we're going to bring this and just bring on, like, cyan metal, just to bring a little bit of... And there we go, and I can... Blue... Blade. Enter. There we go. I can do the same with the gun. Let's check development. Researching loaded. Grab some of that. Cool with that. And shields. Cool. I'm good with that for now. I see you're in good condition after your first mission. As a veteran, it's always good to see a pilot doing fine. In the old days, we were where we still need to get out there and risk getting injured with all the void particles, I would wear a protective suit and have you run by the doctors before anything already. Those things itches a lot, I tell you. Remember Kale telling you before he joined the company that he was once a very esteemed frontier engineer. Now it's all long range controls. If we managed to survive, more pilots would have survived. In the history, you once saw footage of large construction machinery is defending a building against quarks. It is said... So I assume you're perfectly fine. Was afraid your feedback transmission will hurt you, but seeing... This thing's staying tall with my damage. Yeah, I was worried about you too, lad. Or... Okay. If you want to read this... Because... I have... I'm dyslexic, so I kind of have a hard time... Go loaded engine OS. Okay. It's been a few days from your last mission. Now you're thinking a lot on Kale's words. Last time you spent, you've got some time without any missions. It's getting hard. Talking more with everyone helps. You've been dead set on becoming a pilot and just follow orders from WDF. Now you've got much more responsibilities you'll need to learn about every possible aspect. Commander, there's a mission posted by w WDF requiring help from anybody who's available. My calculations, we will still be making profit and it will be beneficial to every side. Come meet me in the mission briefing room. So let's do one more mission. I'll accept the mission on the system. 
should be calling it. That wasn't even a minute. Now I'm wondering if the mission that people think it's too dangerous or not playing enough. Thank you very much for a quick response. I will now explain the mission to the commander. Around three hours ago, we were supposed to receive supplies from the shelter that sent to us airborne. However, the supply package did not reach the designation area that it should be sent to. Was that due to a snowstorm that often happens around that area? Exactly, these unpredictable snowstorms have blown away the supplied packages. We were about to send a retrieval team alongside our mass units, but during this time, most of us are out on missions. We will assign you to one area along other PMCs as supplies are quite scattered. Please get rid of any quarks in the area. Stand by with our retrieval package. Oh yeah. Commander, whenever you are ready, please head to the pilot seat and start the mission. Yep. Let's start it. Do one more mission. I really do hope there is like, uh, mass battles. Mission start. Quarks left in the air, quarks, how do I pronounce those? But I definitely want. That looks explosive. Let's not mess with those. actually quite curious of what these things are. I'm sure this game is quite a bit harder than just normal, but trying to just give a good feel for what this game is and if you want to play it hardcore you can or you can just play it casually like I am just because I absolutely love mechs and I would love for there to be what the fudge are those
Okay. So they're not... Use a little bit of a range. There we go. Mission clear. So you can see the missions. You can kind of blow through the missions relatively fast. Four minutes to do a mission. Exciting from the pilot controls, you saw Rena standing right beside you, looking at the monitor, watching your mask returning back to headquarters on autopilot. The snow fields would be much nicer if they weren't for all the storms and quirks, don't you know, think? By the way, Waltz came around just now, mentioned he had something he wanted to talk to you about, Commander. Can you visit him in the armory? Well, I don't want to spoil the story too much for you guys. Go check out Mass. I believe it's $25 on Steam. It's well worth the money, especially if you like the old animes of Gundam. Or even if you're a fan of like the MechWarrior series. Thank you all for watching. Have a great day.